Hi, when you first buy a Bosch or Siemens washing machine and then it arrives and it's all unpacked and connected, then you look at the range of programs around the middle and sometimes it can be confusing because there's a lot to choose from and a lot of the programs are probably different from your old washing machine. This has actually come from one of my subscribers that said that when you got the machine it can be quite confusing as to which program to pick. So I thought I'd come up with a video to show you some hints and tips and some advice on which programs to use. But just before we start, all I'd normally say is please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Just give us a quick thumbs up, click subscribe. What I do is I talk about household appliances like these. Uh, I do specialise in things like cordless vacuums and there's normally a bit of tech in there as well. So just give us a quick thumbs up, subscribe and then we'll make a start. Although I've got a Siemens washing machine here to show you, the programmes and everything on here are very very similar to a lot of the Bosch machines. Uh, because they're essentially they are the same company, uh, a lot of the programmes and things like the wash times are very similar as well. Uh, but first of all, it is to note that when you are picking your programme, have a look at the load sizes that you can put into the machine. Now, what you will find on, on some washing machines, although it will show you the, uh, the time remaining, it may show you the maximum load that you can put into the washing machine as well. Now this isn't on all of the machines, it's mainly on some of the, I suppose, medium to higher end Bosch and Siemens washers. Uh, but what you will find is that that's really, really important in choosing the programme. And I'll try and explain a bit more about that in a moment. So the first programme is the cotton programme. Uh, now this is, I suppose, the main programme. Uh, what you tend to find is that it's for the, the hardware in fabrics, such as the cotton and linen. linen. So things like t-shirts, bed linen, towels, tablecloths. So, and you'll find that this one is one of the few programs where you can actually adjust the temperature all the way up to 90 degrees. Uh, a lot of the programs around here, uh, you are limited by the temperatures. So if it is something a bit more substantial, if you want to, to do a full load and go all the way up to 90. So if you wanted to get, say, your whites uh, nice and clean and you wanted to put it on a very high temperature, then this is the main one to choose. Uh, the other, I suppose, the sister one to that is the, the colour program. Uh, and what you'll also find is that the, again, you can put a full 9 kilogram load in here. Uh, what you will find, and um, again, as far as the temperature, you can go up to 90 degrees. So they tend to, I suppose, work alongside each other. You will find on these programs that the duration of the program is very long. So you are looking around three hours, uh, and you can find so I just went back down here so even on the 40 degree wash you're looking at four and a half hours and you know for, for a lot of people that's quite a long program uh, I suppose it's something that you, you have to bear in mind when you first put the machine on um, what you will find is that the the longer the wash that normally the more energy efficient the program is and the better the wash performance so a lot of people are into thinking that the the very quick programs so if you can do a full load in around half an hour that it's going to be more energy efficient. Well it's not really the case and also what you will find is that the performance of the wash will not be as good as if you're doing a full longer wash. Now one hint or tip on the Siemens or Bosch washing machines is to look out for this option called Vario Speed or on the Bosch washers it's called Speed Perfect. And what this will do is this will reduce it so if you're on the cotton program as you can see at the moment it takes 3 hours 28 if you press that, although it does reduce the load size, it reduces it by over half. So it's reduced that down to an hour and a half. But what you will find is that the machines are intelligent enough on both Bosch and Siemens to take in the amount of water required according to the wash load. And what you can find is that, that it can change the wash time as well. So if you've only put, say, three or four items in, then what you can find is even then it wouldn't wash for the full hour and a half, it would reduce the wash time as well. And it's the other way as well. So if you were to uh, put too much washing in, then it could go over that. Uh, if you put too much liquid or detergent in, then it will take longer than the hour and a half as well, because it needs to uh, provide extra water for the rinses. Now the next main program uh, that is for the full load option is something called Eco 40 to 60. Now this program is it's quite a new one, um, it's, it is a requirement on a lot of modern washing machines so you should find that every washing machine has, should have this option. Now this is really designed and uh, as you can see here you can still wash a full load in it uh, but you don't normally have the temperature options so it is quite limiting 
But what it will do is it will normally wash at say 40 degrees. Uh, but it, this is designed for clothes that are designed to be washed between 40 and 60 to be put in at the same time. Uh, it is something that, again, you will find it's quite a long wash, so it's around three and a half hours. And as far as the various speed option, you don't have that with this wash because it is designed as a very economical wash. So this is a really good program to use. If you are concerned about things like water and electricity consumption, uh, and if, but if you want a really good wash performance and you're not too worried about the time of the program then that's really the one to use. So I don't really want to do this in any particular order uh, but the next one I will show you is the Easy Care. Uh, now this is a good program uh, for lighter loads so you will find that on this machine so this is the 9 kilogram machine that the maximum load you can put in here is 4 kilograms so that's something to bear in mind. Uh, but this is quite a basic program for washing less hard wearing fabrics such as fine cotton, synthetic fibres or blending fabrics. Um, and this is really a good one for things like your shirts or blouses, uh, but also t-shirts that are made of delicate cotton and other coloured fabrics. Uh, so it, again, what you need to do is you need to sort your colours out before you put them in the machine. Uh, but you will find it's not quite as long a programme as some of the, uh, the full size, I suppose, the, the full nine kilogram programmes. So about, about two and a half hours. Um, and again with that you can reduce the uh, the wash time on here so if you're in a hurry then you've got the option to reduce that as well. Now the next program is this one this is the delicates and silk. Now a lot of people I think get a little bit nervous about washing uh, things like delicates or, or silk items uh, but brands like Bosch and Siemens have come up with these dedicated programs that are designed to protect the, the fabric and as you can see here, it is a very small load, it's only a two kilogram load. Uh, but what you will find is that these are particularly designed for machine washable silk and satin. So just have a look in the, the labels just to make sure they are machine washable. Um, what you will find is that the, uh, the machine it will only spin at a lower spin speed as well. So the maximum spin speed is up to 800 RPM. Uh, so you can't go all the way up to 1400. Um, and Again, it's recommended that you don't wash these with rough fabrics. So if you are putting things like silk items in there, then don't put a towel in as well, because uh, you can find that it, uh, it doesn't look after the fabrics as it should do. And the next one here, the, the woolen program. Uh, again, it is one of those that um, I think, again, some people put, get a little bit nervous about putting woolen items into a washing machine. Uh, some people are quite used to hand washing these. Because uh, what you can find is that wool becomes matted when it's subject to heat and moisture and movement. Uh, so it, it sometimes doesn't look that great when it comes out of the washer. Uh, it is recommended to try and use a specific detergent for woolens. Uh, you can find if you do use that then the performance of the wash will be better. Uh, and also it can look after the fabric as well. Now although the Delicates and Silk are pretty specific programs, uh, you come round to a bit more generic program. So you've got the mixed fabrics. Again, it's only a smaller load, so it's only up to four kilograms. It's not like the full nine kilogram around here. Uh, but what you'll find with this, so the mixed fabrics are really designed for mixed items of laundry made from various hard wearing and easy care fabrics. Uh, so that can be quite a, a good generic one. And especially as it's quite a quick program as well. So you're looking at doing the, uh, the four kilogram load in just under an hour. Uh, as, as we come round to this one, this is the, the dark wash. Uh, which is on quite a few of the Bosch and Siemens washers. Uh, these are really designed for dark fabrics made of cotton or blended fabrics. So it could be things like jeans. Uh, so with this, the, the laundry is washed with an increased water level uh, for a particularly gentle treatment of colours and the fabric. What you can also find is that the detergent residue is avoided by rinsing with more water than normal. So it will actually use a bit more water in this kind of program. And then the washing spun gently to prevent the creases in, for example, the jeans during the spin cycle. So that could be a good one. If you do wash a lot of jeans, for example, then that could be a good program to use. Now the next program on here is the duvet program. Uh, this is very similar to another program that Bosch and Siemens use called the curtain program. Uh, the, the whole washing concept is, is pretty similar. Now what you will find is that it's, it, although it says two and a half kilograms, uh, clearly if you're going to put a duvet in there then it will I suppose almost fill it but that really depends on the size of the duvet that you've got. 
And what you can find is that this, uh, basically during the program you get high water levels during the washing and rinsing. Uh, so it's not quite as energy efficient as some of the other programs. Uh, but things like the spin speeds are lower than on other wash programs. And then the water is quickly drained at the end of the program by spinning. So the duvet or the curtains can be hung up damp uh, rather than the machine trying to spin. Because uh, what you will find is that if you've got a full load of the duvet in there, then it will struggle to spin it properly. So really it's better to take it out while it's still damp, hang it up and then let it dry. Now the next program on here is shirts, um, or on some of them it's called shirts and blouses, but essentially it's the same program. Uh, now this is really designed for shirts and blouses, obviously. Uh, but what you'll find is that nowadays there are a lot more uh, non-iron shirts. Uh, it's one of those jobs ironing that a lot of people don't really look forward to. Um, I know some people do, but uh, I know personally I'm not a huge fan of it. Uh, so if I can buy a, a non-iron shirt, then I'm always for that. And what you'll find is that if, if you are going to wash things like that, then if you select this program, the shirts, and especially if you select the less ironing, what it would do is it will actually reduce the spin on here. Uh, so because a, a lot of the manufacturers of non-iron shirts will recommend that they're hung up. So rather than take them out and put them in a tumble dryer, which some people want to do, take them out when they've been spun at a low spin and let them dry naturally. Uh, you can find that uh, if you provide that, so that either less ironing or easy iron function on some, some of the models, then you can find that letting them dry naturally uh, will be the way to go. Uh, and what you'll find is that this is a really good program. So again, it's only a two kilogram load, so it's quite a small load. Uh, but that's a really good one, especially if the, the shirts and blouses that you're washing are you know, quite expensive. The, some of the fabrics on these are, are very, very nice. And clearly what you want to do is you want to take care of these fabrics. And what you don't want to do, which I'm sure a lot of people do tend to do, is just to put all the clothes in at the same time with your towels and everything else. Because you will find that um, that's not really the way to look after your clothes. So one of the next options on here is to show you is the outdoor. Uh, now this is a really good one for things like washing waterproof clothes, uh, sportswear and any outdoor clothing. Uh, things like any clothes with say membrane technology as they call it. Uh, as you can see it is a smaller load, it's only a one kilogram load. So it's a very small load on here. Um, and what it does, it, it just washes the fabrics gently uh, and has a spin cycle that's specifically designed uh, for predominantly water impermeable clothes and what you'll find is that it is recommended to wash these fabrics with less detergent so don't use us the same amount of detergent as normal uh, and because of that because you're using less detergent then you may need to wash them more often I suppose that really depends on how dirty the, the clothes are getting you know if you're going outdoor uh, say hiking or walking then you can find that you may need to wash them a little bit more often than normal now the next program on here, and I'd say one of the most popular ones that people tend to use, is the Rapid 15 or 30. Or on the Bosch machines it's called Super Quick 15 or Super Quick 30. And what you'll find is that these programs, as I say, are 15 minutes and 30 minute programs. Now they are for smaller loads, as you can see here the 30 minute program is only a 4 kilogram load. And if we press the vario speed, or the speed perfect on the Bosch, then you will find that that's reduced to two kilograms and it comes down to 15 minutes. Now these programs are, they, they are very good. Uh, what you'll find is that they're excellent for things like freshening up clothes. If you've just got, say, a couple of items you want to wash really quickly, they're not physically dirty, they just need a quick freshen up, then these are very good programs to use. Um, what I will say is don't rely on these to do your normal load. Um, some people think that you can still do a full wash in around half an hour. Now I mean some brands, uh, some of the Turkish brands are promoting a 28 minute wash and personally I'm not a huge fan of them. Uh, we've had a lot of people say that they're not impressed with the, the wash performance. So although you have got these quick programs on here, then don't get hooked up onto these kind of program. I would always concentrate on some of the fuller programs. Now a lot more machines have got this option on here now called the drum clean. And as it says, it will clean the drum. And this is really designed to wash it to high temperature. 
So you don't put anything in there. You don't need to put any any clothes or anything in that program. Uh, you can put some sachets or detergent in there if you want to to try and help keep the machine clean. Uh, but this is really designed, uh, as it says, with no clothes in there at all. Uh, but it takes around an hour and ten minutes, so it's not a, a quick program. Uh, but it's something that we'd always recommend doing, ideally once a month. Uh, what we always say is when you first get the machine to do this, uh, just to flush through the system, and then what you'll find is if you do it every month, even when it is new, then it can help to reduce the uh, things like the build-up of mildew, which you can get around the, the rubber, around the door seal sometimes. And some of the programs at the bottom that are quite generic across both Bosch and Siemens washing machines, you've got things like the rinse, and then you've got the spin and drain. Uh, so with the rinse, what that will do is clearly, as it says, it will go through a, a rinse program. Uh, but what you can find is that you can uh, enable a spin speed as well, but you don't have to. So you can just spin something, or just rinse something, I mean, and then not spin it if you want to. Uh, but what I suppose what most people tend to do is to rinse and spin or if you have hand wash something Then you have got the option to spin and drain or just drain on its own So I just hopped over to one of the Bosch washing machines just to show you some of the different programs that are on offer Compared to the Siemens washer that I've been showing you so far as you can see a lot of the programs are very similar So you've got things like the shirts the dark wash delicate silks and the, the sportswear um, what you will find, you, there are a couple of extra programs, so you've got things like the Allergy Plus. The main advantage of this, if, if you have got somebody in the household that suffers with allergies, then what this kind of program will do is to add extra rinses at the end of the program. Uh, on quite a few machines you have got the option for things like extra rinse, so that's pretty standard on a lot of washers as well. You have got things like the, the Night Wash, uh, so with this, if you're going to use things like Economy 7, or if you've got cheap electricity during the night, if you're going to use the time delay especially, then the night wash is a great option to use. And what you'll find is it doesn't normally spin at the full spin speed, so it just tries to keep the noise level down, which can be important, especially if you're in a flatter apartment and if you've got other people around that are quite sensitive to a noisy washing machine. And all I'll do here is just to show you quickly uh, across some of the different models. Uh, so this is a Bosch Serie 2, and you'll find that here that the display is quite basic. Uh, they are very simple to use. As you go over here, we go up to one of the Series 4 models. And with this one, it's quite, again, very simple to use. You've still got the program dial here. Uh, and this is one of the alternative models. This is the uh, eight kilogram, 1400 spin. Uh, so the display is a little bit more comprehensive on here. But a lot of the programs we've talked about are, are on this model. Uh, where you've got, again, things like the Cottons, Eco 40-60. to 60. Uh, They call it intensive on here, uh, compared to the coloured on the Siemens washers, but a lot of the, uh, I suppose, easy care programmes, woolen, are still on here. Uh, on the Bosch models, they call it Super Quick 15 and 30. Uh, I know it's slightly different to on the Siemens. And then as we hop over, as we go up in the range, so we're going up to some of the Series 6 models, and with these, as you can see, the display is a lot nicer. Uh, it is actually a touch control display. So that's that's really good, that's quite impressive. But again, a lot of the programs around here are very similar. So you've still got the dark wash shirt, sportswear, so a lot of those are, are very similar. And then as we go towards the top of the range, this is one of the IDOS machines. IDOS as a concept is something that's been around for several years now, that Bosch and Siemens have come up with and it's not really taken off in the UK as it should have done uh, I don't think a lot of people tend to understand it a huge amount uh, but in a nutshell what it does is it just takes in the amount of liquid detergents required for the wash so rather than guessing and putting way too much in then it will take in the amount of detergent required but essentially the display is very similar so it's a touch control display uh, but as you can see a lot of the programs on here are very similar to the programs we've already looked at. Now you will notice at the bottom here that you have got something called additional programs and what this will do this will enable you to download extra programs to your washing machine. Now a lot of the washing machines now have something called Home Connect uh, which is part of it and that's an app that you download to your phone or tablet 
and when you do that first of all it gives you the option to uh, enable things like service issues so it can talk to Bosch or Siemens direct which can be very good but also what it does with the additional programs have a look on the website and have a look through the app because there might be some other new programs that can help to protect your fabrics and to get a better wash performance. So I hope you enjoyed that quick video and I hope you found it a little bit useful. Hope you've learned something about some of the programs and what they do. Um, because really the, the whole idea is that if you can wash your fabrics and your clothes on certain programs, then you can find that the performance of the wash is a lot better for washing certain items. Uh, so all I'd normally do is please say subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please give us a quick thumbs up. I always ask for comments on the video, whether it's good or bad. If I have missed something, because I know there's a lot of detail in there, and I'm sure there might be certain programs that you want to know what they do. Uh, but if, there, if you have got any uh, questions on any of the programs, on your Bosch or Siemens washer, then pop it in the comments and I'll get back to you. Thanks for watching.